Hey guys, this is Spencer from Pixel and Bracket, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to add text in a photo in a photo show shows up. Yeah. Now let me introduce to y'all the one son of a musician refuse to fall. Adding text in Photoshop is a pretty simple process. What we're gonna be doing is adding a type layer in our layers panel over here. And there's two different ways or two different types of type layers that we can add. So the first thing we need to do is grab our type tool over here in the toolbar. The shortcut key for that is T. And then we can just click on our canvas and you'll see the little uh, flashing icon pops up that allows us to type out some text. So we can just type out text here. And if your uh, text is defaulting to white, you could select it all with Command A, go up here to your uh, character panel here and then change the color of that to black for instance. Now we've got that text in there, you can change the font, you can change the uh, font weight, the size of it. This is anti-aliasing so it affects the uh, edges of our text and you can change the, that to different styles as well. We can justify it left, centered, to the right, or actually that would be aligning it. Um, you can type on an arc, we can do other paragraph options and character options in here, you know, superset. Uh, all caps, you know, and you can stretch your text, which don't stretch your text, you don't need to do that. You can also set the baseline shift, and then we can go to our paragraph options as well. And this is where we can align it, we can indent it, and do all sorts of different things, or hyphenate our paragraph. Now the reason that the justify text options aren't available is because this text box has no bounds. So if I keep typing and typing and typing and typing and typing, it, it'll never end. I, it'll just keep going in a straight line until I literally break it and hit enter and then start typing uh, some more. I cannot spell on that one. How do I get a text box where I can justify text, where it wraps text? To do that, instead of clicking on our canvas, we're going to select that type tool again and then click and drag. And we're going to actually create a text box that has boundaries. Your text will wrap inside of this text box. And you'll also be able to use your justification tools if you go to your paragraph settings. You can justify uh, with the last line being to the left or with everything being justified. And then as long as you have your type tool selected, you can edit the bounds of this text box to increase or decrease it and adjust how your type wraps, how it justifies, and where it's placed. From there, you can see in our layers panel that it's just created two type layers. These layers we can move around like any other layer. We can hit Command T and scale it up like any other layer. We can also just go back to our type tool and click on that to edit it again. Or you can double click on the T here in your layers panel, the little uh, thumbnail, and it'll open up that text box for it to be editable. Well, anyway, I hope this tutorial helped you guys. I know I kind of got a little wordy, but if you like this video, uh, like this video and subscribe for more tips and tutorials until next time you guys Thanks for watching and I'll see you later